wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Man, it feels like the Red Sox when they were cursed because I felt like I was getting cursed. Because of all <laughs> yeah. those final appearances. Yeah, you know, five times in a row and not win is just, it's hard, you know. But uh, I'm really proud of these guys. I'm, I'm super proud of them. I can't be more proud of as a coach, and um, thank you. It's been so long for you, man. How does this feel? It feels great. You know, especially against them, you know, that revenge for my sophomore year, my first year of high school playing, you know, there's no better feeling. Also, beating them the way we did, it's awesome. It's awesome, man. I told my defense, you gotta lock in. I said, they only key with two players. When nine is at wide out, they're throwing the ball. When 10 is at running back, when 10 is at wide out, they're running the ball with number nine. I said, all we gotta do is stay in our zones. The ball's gonna come right to us. And you see what was happening when the ball came right to me and I played my spot. Came down, took the pick. I was, I was, I was in my side. I came over and caught that pick. See you for me? We play as a team. Once you play as a team, you win championships. And defense, defense win championships. We felt like we, we were getting the momentum. We, we kept making mistakes, you know, just silly mental mistakes. Um, we felt like we should have been up at, been up 14 points early. And we, we make a mistake in the end zone. It's just little small things like that, but we always know we could put up points. So we wasn't like frantic or worried. Um, we just wanted to come out and finish them.
just found the mismatches. You know, we have great athletes all over the field. My O-line did a great job protecting protecting me, and it gave me time to throw the ball to Davian and Davion. You know, it was, it was just a great game plan all around. This We had a great practices this week leading up to the championship, and you've seen how it affected us on the field. No, it was a matter of defense, defense finishing the game. We knew offense could score, but we, we need our defense to stop, stop them. And once we stopped them, we won. No, they, 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 they couldn't stop us at all. I, I, had, I, had, I had no doubt that when I threw the ball, that my guy was going to come down with that. I had no doubt in that. It's, a, it's amazing. It's like, it's like having... Two, two of the same people on the field, literally. You know, I have two of the same people I can trust to just give them the ball and they're gonna make a play about, make a play on it. That's like our um, Jamar Chase and T Higgins with uh, Joe Burrow at will quarterback. That's a that's a dominant trio at receiver. I'm just one of them. I just help out. So good. Having one. I've I've been in the championship since I was in high school. I'm glad to win. Finally. Finally. You know, I felt like our team, they, they fought really hard last year. The thing about this team is they fight for each other. So, and, it, and it's just different that they fight for each other because they'll do anything for each other. And that's a family. They're not the most talented group, but they play together and they play hard as a family. And that's why they win. Coach Mo, you guys obviously have tributes to him. How much do you guys feel him change today? Oh man, his family's here, his wife is here, um, you know, I gave her a big hug, um, we're, just, we're just so happy to actually do it for Coach Mo. We couldn't finish last year, but we know he was here watching today, and we love you, Coach Mo. I always wanted to play here since I was a kid. My dad and my brother always, they, um, they worked here when I was a kid at the games, and they always told me they wanted me to play here, and it feels great to get a championship win here.